naked speed. Chris is a good guy to work with. He's real calm. He makes it interesting. I love my old tools. And you know, every time I have to go out and buy something new, I'm always disappointed in the quality. Yeah, Chris's tools are pretty much antiques. He seems to think that the old stuff's built better, and in some cases it is. All right, there's the last part. You can put it together. You should teach Rebecca to weld it. I mean, why not? She wants to be involved. You know, let's give her something to be involved with. Training bracket, what the hell? It ain't yeah. gonna hurt if it falls off. I agree. Sure, why not? I've never done it before, but go ahead and teach me. Let's do the firing bracket. Okay. Start by tacking it. So just a little spot? Yep. Closer. It's stuck. There you go. Got it. To the back side. No, we gotta, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> My wife's been working in the motorcycle industry for 22 years, and she doesn't know how to weld, and I would never invite her into the workshop. Never, never, never. That's called a man cave for a good reason. Longer. Oh, I get it. Yep, there you go. I gave her a few pointers, and just like everything else she does, she just jumps in and does it well. Perfect. Okay. Now we can mount the fairing on the bike. I think I did okay. I'm a perfectionist, though, and I would have liked it to be absolutely spot on perfect, but, you know, give me a few more minutes or an hour or two, and I think I'll have it down.